helpful ways to make anyone chase you. Number one, give room for mystery. Why are mysterious people so attractive? What is it about the silent and mysterious types that make you wanna learn more about them? Let's look at Levi Ackerman from the Attack on Titan series. He is pretty silent and detached, but somehow has a whole army of fans screaming in support and adoration. So what makes his brooding character so appealing? According to Simone Radeli, PhD, mystery is linked to fascination. When humans encounter something unfamiliar, they'll most likely explore to acquire more information. This type of behavior may be linked to the early humans who were constantly faced with danger and had to develop strategies to overcome them. According to Radeli, a mysterious setting easily attracts us as a potential source of unprecedented knowledge and is therefore a source of fascination. So if you want to become that source, try finding more ways to add mystery to your life. You could start by spending less time on social media and more on your hobbies. Focus on your own goals and practice listening more than speaking, shifting the focus to the other person and less on you. Number two, develop your physical appearance. Have you ever been interested in someone because of their appearance alone? There's no shame in following people online because you find them drop dead gorgeous. Good looking people just tend to receive more attention. But why is that? Several different studies have found that when we rate people as good looking, we tend to believe that they have positive personality traits and that they're more intelligent, so are more likely to receive benefits like being paid more, getting considered for more jobs and having stronger social skills. This contrast in treatment is also highlighted in the webtoon Lookism, where the main character, Daniel Park, who was bullied for being chubby and weak, suddenly becomes a highly popular and agreeable individual after waking up with a more attractive body. Another study showed attractiveness is also highly linked with higher levels of self-esteem. This means that if you're interested in increasing your appeal, it may help to develop confidence in your capabilities and looks. Maybe you need a haircut or even a new style. Whatever it is, it's good to explore and do things that make you feel empowered and self-assured. Practice dressing well, taking care of your hygiene, and learning how to best express yourself socially. Exercise and having a balanced diet have also been shown to have positive effects on your self-esteem. Lastly, try embracing your bad qualities and highlighting the good ones. Developing your physical appearance isn't something done in a day. It's a byproduct of how you choose to live your life. You're already stunning, but maybe it's time to elevate it. Number three, keep yourself busy. Aside from being mysterious, it's also good to fill your schedule with fun and productive activities. This doesn't mean playing hard to get, of course. If people start asking you out and you wanna socialize with them, do it. Try to avoid playing mind games like breadcrumbing, benching, and playing hard to get to make them miss you more. Those tactics are defense mechanisms and survival instincts for people with insecure attachment styles. Sometimes you may feel like you aren't being chased because you have too much free time on your hands. It's good to be preoccupied with other things and let life flow naturally. You could try hiking, going to the gym, or maybe even partying. By being more active and productive, you can meet new people, create more relationships, and increase the quality of your social life. And number four, be the best version of yourself at this moment. Everyone is different and therefore chases after different types of people. So how can you be the best version of yourself? Whether you're an introvert, extrovert, or ambivert, there's always an aspect of yourself that you can work on. Try not to fight it too much. In learning ways to make people chase after you, it may get easy to forget the most important tip of all, being genuine. As much as possible, avoid pretending to be someone you're not. Instead, identify the qualities you admire and slowly integrate them into your life. Which qualities do you chase after and why? If it's physical attractiveness, then perhaps it might help to focus on exercise and developing your looks. And if it's personality or self-esteem, you may wanna focus on self-reflection, developing habits and saying affirmations. Remember, we are all works in progress and there will always be someone appreciating you. Have you ever chased after someone? What made you do it? How did it end? Share your experiences down below. If you know someone who may enjoy this video, please share it with them. As usual, the references and studies used are in the description below. Until next time, friends, take care.